Hi, I'm Jessica and I'm your host tonight here with Breezeway Productions for the 100th anniversary of Jackie Coogan. I'm here today with grandson Keith Coogan. How are you? I am awesome. Thank you for celebrating with us. Now what made you come out tonight and support this? Um, my support is for Keith and his family. Uh, obviously uh, going back to the beginning days, I mean Jackie Coogan literally was the first child star so he's a legacy in and of himself he is an icon but not only that not only was he the first child star but he was also the first child star to transcend into adult stardom so he represents a lot of what actors like Keith and myself you know represent which is crossing generational gaps and being able to stay alive in this industry for more than a decade or more than two decades or what have you. Well, I'm an ex-child actor and, and Keith Coogan is the reason that we have money and that we, I made money from the show that I was on. Now, what made you come out tonight and support this cause? You know what? Um, the whole Coogan Law actually benefited all the child actors, you know, and it was something so great. And I'm, I'm very thankful that I had the type of loving parents that were there and, and that took everything into, you know, into account for my benefit. And, um, and But the Coogan Law was there to protect us and thank God that they did it. Jackie was such a pioneer, uh, you know, for all of us child actors. So, I mean, everything he did in paving the way for us to be able to do what we did live the lives we were able to and the protections we were able to enjoy were pretty profound. Well Keith is a good friend of mine and I actually to be honest with you until yesterday I didn't realize who his grandfather was and the kid is such an amazing movie and so special to my heart he paved the way for actors you know, for generations from that and because I'm an actress and Keith is an actor it's just amazing to me the generational effects that people can have on each other. The Jackie Coogan Law is what created those bonds to be produced back then. Okay. So I came into a, a financial whim, you know, whim basically back then and so did Darby and I think he bought a house off of it and there was quite a few stars that we didn't know that that money existed and if it wasn't for Jack, the Jackie Coogan Law that would have never happened. Now tell us one of your best memories with your grandfather. My grandfather, uh, he didn't really teach me how to act. Uh, he expected me to uh, behave professionally on the set. Um, he did teach me how to play chess. And he'd studied with grandmasters when he was a small child. And But he taught me patiently. And over the summers, I started to get better. And I started to get closer to winning. And if I ever got close to checkmating him, he would suddenly need to get up for another glass of iced tea and accidentally knock the board over. So it was, uh, finally I did beat him. And uh, soundly, he had uh, castled and I, I, I got him. He taught me the trip hammer attack. And um, beating my grandfather in chess was a great moment. He didn't take it well, but uh, he was always a, a gracious man. It was great growing up with him. Uh, Jack, uh, it would have been your 100th birthday. and. Um, I know we had your last birthday just down the street at the old Brown Derby, and um, I know you're here tonight, so happy birthday.